is fast acting, non-invasive, and it can take the pain of getting an IV actually out of the equation. Today I got to see something called the J-tip at Cincinnati Children's Hospital. Call it a modern day spoonful of sugar that helps the medical procedure get done. Colin, have you had an IV before? Uh, yes. We met 17-year-old Colin Richardson in prep before his surgery today. What were you most nervous about? Uh, definitely the IV. Turns out this is a right place, right time moment for easing his tension. Cincinnati Children's just started using something staffers say takes the pain out of the stick. Want to give you a close up on the gadget they call the J-tip and the most notable thing is right here, no needle. Instead, it uses a CO2 cartridge to force lidocaine, a numbing agent, under the skin. We would put it here like this. And is that about the amount of pressure that you would apply? Um, yeah, that's. It's, it's nothing. Not, it's not very much. Back in Colin's room, we watched the process. Do you have any questions about your IV before she starts? No. The nurse found a vein with an ultrasound machine. <laughs> then she numbed the area with the non-invasive J-tip. That little spot you see is the pain-free zone for the invasive needle. Colin says the IV went in, no issues. Worked very well. I didn't feel the needle going in at all. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> So that's kind of like an alleluia moment, yeah. isn't it? If yeah. you don't feel it. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> and that is a big deal when you consider this. Each child, when they come to the medical center, usually the first question they ask is, am I getting any shots? Will I get any pokes? And so that's definitely the biggest fear for not only the children, but I feel for parents as well. They're smiling with good reason over there. It's why child life staffers worked with hospital nurses to bring the more pain-free option to young patients. They're working to remove the fear because they say studies show unmanaged pain during one little needle poke as a child can lead to lifelong needle phobia, and that can lead to chronic avoidance of routine health care, something mm. we absolutely don't want. You